What's up everybody, welcome back to Selenix Crypto, hope you're all doing great and welcome back to this new video on Render and the RNDR token, as we should perhaps uh, refer to it as. Uh, but in this video I wanted to take a, uh, take a look at Render again, wanted to mainly focus on technicals, perhaps a little bit of fundamentals, um, if at least we understand fundamentals as kind of what's going on in the markets. But yeah, just wanted to give you my thoughts. Um, I need to get back into it a little bit because the three videos before this I, I covered meme coins and that's always a little bit diff different to make videos and analysis on that. Um, but all right, so we'll talk about Render in this uh, video. Before we get into that, if you want to receive daily trading signals from me, check out the links down in the description or in the pinned comments and there you will find instructions on how to join. But now let's get into Render. So. Uh, right now, the situation for Render is, um, is is pretty stable. In the end, we dropped down all the way to 1.65, but we have solidified support there. We even got a little bit of a bullish breakout. Then we got rejected off of this 3A2 FIP with the 200 EMA. Altogether, this was a, a very strong resistance level. Uh, so it was to be expected that we would find resistance there. And now we're just, um, I would say we're actually consolidating or at least getting into some sort of a consolidation, because if you would just have to assess render, uh, like like how you see it right now, you would still say it's a downtrend, right? Especially with this uh, with this trend line coming down. Um, the thing though is, is that, like I said, we actually found a strong support. We got some bullish momentum from that support. Um, and apart from that, the ADX is also dropping. So if the ADX is dropping, Indicators like this 100 EMA and this trend line and this Fibonacci level, they are not as strong as, as when the market is trending, all right? So that usually means that volume has dropped down and that you get a little bit less movement. And you can also see that the volume right now, volume still is amazing, I would say. Um, and by the way, Render is also an amazing project. I really think so. I think it's here, here to stay and I think it's here to grow. Um, but, um, but yeah, so volume is dropping down, but it's still good. Um, but usually those are all indicators that we are going into some sort of a consolidation. So right now, I would say that the consolidation area, um, for now at least, will be between this level here around 1.9, perhaps 1.95 and 1.65. And the big thing that could change something like that, the big thing that could actually get us out of that consolidation is big moves from the market. Um, and that's what we're going to get usually. And this week is a pretty big week in terms of economic events. I will keep you up to date on that in my in my Bitcoin and my Ethereum videos. Uh, but altogether, usually the Sunday to the Monday, that transition, so the beginning of the week, usually that's a day of a lot of volatility and a lot of new volume coming into the market, right? So then you have, you don't have a lot of volume. So more money, or at least the same money will do more in terms of volatility than uh, normally during the week. So usually you get a lot of new new volume going, going into the market and that will kind of determine direction. Um, so one of the big things I would advise you to check out today is what Bitcoin does. If Bitcoin actually opens bullish and we can get up to 27,400, I think Render can actually rally quite a bit as well, up to like 1.9, 1.95. But I think, like I said, I think we're more consolidating. So I think we will find resistance there. And from there slowly at least drop down down to down to 1.85 and 1.77 and then if the market actually remains very bullish all right then we might actually be able to get all the way up to two dollars and 2.05 again and if the market also consolidates so for example if the market open, op opens bullish and we get up to 27,400 from there we drop back down to 26,600 then render will just do the same and stay in that consolidation which we are arguably in right now and if the market opens bearish, same thing. Render will drop down to 1.65, hold it as support, and, uh, and and then from there we'll see again. So right now, um, I, I never like to do analysis this way, but it just really depends on what Bitcoin does. And depending on that, at least now, hopefully you, you have some, so, some sort of a framework of what to expect. But depending on that, we will either uh, uh, stay in this consolidation or have a chance to actually break out to the upside or the downside. But that's my take on Render for now. If you do have any questions, let me know. But for now, thank you for watching. Take care and bye.